In this video, I'm going to share with you real, practical, and reliable ways to identify genuine emerald gemstones and raw natural diamonds using simple methods you can test at home. These tips are based on basic geology, gemology, and field experience used by professionals around the world. So, if you've ever wondered whether the stone you found might be real emerald or raw diamond, listen closely and follow each step carefully. How to identify a genuine emerald? Let's start with emerald. Emerald is a precious gemstone from the beryl family, colored green by natural chromium or vanadium, but not every green stone is a real emerald. Here are the most important signs to look for. Number one, color quality. A real emerald has a deep, rich, intense green color. The green should not be neon and not too light. If the stone looks perfectly clean or the color is too uniform, it may be synthetic or glass. Number two, inclusions the garden effect. Most natural emeralds contain natural inclusions known as jardin, which means garden. These are small fractures, bubbles, or mineral lines inside the stone. If you look with a flashlight or a phone light and see natural patterns, not perfect clarity, that is a good sign of a real emerald. Three, hardness test. Emerald has a hardness of about 7.5 to 8 on the Mohs scale. This means it can scratch metal and most other stones, but it should not scratch easily. Be careful, emerald can fracture if hit, so don't strike it. Simply try scratching a piece of glass lightly. A real emerald will leave a scratch. Under four, temperature test. Real emerald stirs cool to the touch for a few seconds, even after holding it in your hand. Glass warms up quickly. This is a simple but effective home test. Five, magnification test. Use your phone's camera zoom. Look for natural lines, small fractures, and tiny mineral spots. If the stone looks too perfect or shows round air bubbles, it is probably glass or synthetic crystal. Conclusion for Emerald. When you combine color, inclusions, hardness, and temperature, you can get a very good idea of whether your emerald is natural or not. But for 100% confirmation, gemological labs use spectroscopy and refractive index tests. Shape natural crystal form. Raw diamonds often form in specific shapes. Octahedral, like two pyramids joined, cubic, triangular growth lines, sharp edges, and clean natural faces. If the scone has rounded edges, it's likely quartz, not diamond. Conductivity test. Diamonds conduct heat extremely well. If you breathe on the stone, the fog disappears almost instantly. On glass or quartz, the fog stays for two or three seconds. This is a simple and very reliable field test. Density test. Diamonds are heavier than quartz and most common stones. If two stones look the same size, the diamond will feel noticeably heavier in your hand. Loop or phone zoom test. Use your camera zoom or a magnifier. Real diamonds never show bubbles inside. You may see tiny black spots, carbon lines, or natural flaws, but not rounded air bubbles. Air bubbles are the trademark of glass or fake material. The confection. <laughs> Under UV light, many diamonds glow blue or white. Not all diamonds fluoresce, but if the stone glows green or red, it is most likely not a diamond. Final conclusion. If your stone passes the scratch test, fog test, shape test, and bubble inspection, there is a high chance it is a real rough diamond. But to confirm with 100% certainty, gemological labs use advanced tools like Raman spectroscopy, X-ray fluorescence, and thermal conductivity meters.